What's up guys? Just sitting in the backyard with my little guy, uh, watching him play. A little bit rainy today, but whatever, he likes playing in the water. So I uh, wanted to talk about, uh, you know, the market and all that stuff. Like I said, a little reminder, guys, is make sure you're stepping away from your portfolios on red days. If you're not DCAing, then put your portfolio away. Just kind of relax, spend some time with the family. Like I said, I'm outside with my with my little guy. You know, he's playing in the water with his Hot Wheels and stuff. Good times, right, guys? Um, absolutely. So, so anyways, it helps you escape from that. It helps you escape the stress because stress can manifest physically if you allow it to, right? So, in saying that, guys, uh, I wanted to talk about the potential ROI of Jasmine and the risk to reward, guys. Um, because I get, I've been getting asked a lot, as we know, starting to go towards the bull run. We're starting to get a lot of new retail people to crypto. So a lot of new people to the channel and stuff like that. Uh, asking like, you know, why they should buy Jasmine, you know, blah, blah, blah. It's well, raining. Yeah, it's raining, yes. Um, and the thing is that, uh, you know, so I try to tell them guys, like, look. The return to the risk to reward and the, the potential ROI on this project is just too good to kind of pass up, right? Um, think about it. A lot of people, a lot of us were buying at a fifth of a cent, uh, a sixth of a cent, a uh, 20th of a cent, so on, right? Uh, 30th, uh, 30th of a cent, uh, all that fun stuff. Now we're all the way up at like one cent eight right now, I think. It's kind of, Jasmine's kind of pumping right now. I don't have the chart in front of me, but uh, I'm outside, but it's like I was when I was inside, it was like one cent eight. Uh, it's starting to try to work its way back up a little bit here, guys. So it's looking good. We could see some sideways choppy action for the next three or four weeks uh, in, a, in a bull pennant. And there's nothing wrong with that, right? Uh, what I would say is dollar cost average, right? As I always do, right? Dollar cost average. I told you guys that a half a cent, a lot of people made a lot of money because they because they did that. Look at the hiccups because they did that. Um, so in saying that, guys, like think about the risk to reward, guys. It's fantastic. It's absolutely fantastic. The, the utility that this project has... The, the partnerships, Toyotas, uh, you know, Panasonic was just announced, right? And so, so much more to come down the road, guys. Their associations with Sony, the team, the list truly just goes on and on and on in terms of the potential. The PDL, right? Uh, from my understanding, the PDL is already active for Apple users, just not uh, Android. So I'm waiting for that to, to come up for Android so I can use it. Um, and, you know, like, and so much more to go. Like, it's so much more to go, right? We're going to have a, a fantastic 2024, probably a lot more bullish news in 2025 for Jasmine as well. I'm expecting a lot more partnerships and stuff like that. So even just a couple of grand into Jasmine could uh, potentially get you hundreds of thousands of dollars, right? Uh, so it's a fantastic risk to reward scenario. Uh, the return on investment, like I said, uh, I'm expecting about a dollar on the low end, guys. If they reached the KPI goals, if they reached their KPI goals, the the ROI for Jasmine is going to outperform every other crypto out there. It will be number one in terms of performance, guys, because their KPI goals are like $17.87, right? And I've already gone through how they plan on doing that and everything. Um, if you want to know more about that, guys, uh, check out my other videos on how they plan on reaching their goals with KPI. I know this again, I'll say it again because I say it all the time and I'm always right. There's some moron out there that will say in the comments that they can't reach 1787 because they haven't done their research on the TVL and the PDL. Uh, so they'll make a dumb comment. <laughs> There's always one who doesn't do any research and goes online and starts giving financial advice in the comments of people's videos, right? So <laughs> to that one guy, deuces ooses we'll see you at the tippy top right uh to everybody else i say the risk of reward is just way too fantastic to pass up on for jasmine uh i think that the uh the return on investment for jasmine too is going to outshine uh every other crypto out there um so it's definitely worth holding in any portfolio as always guys never financial advice but holding some jasmine in your portfolio could it really hurt to take that risk? Even if you don't like Jasmine, even if you, uh, even if you're, you know, uh, I think it's a scam. Okay. I think some memes are scams. I'll still put a couple hundred bucks into it to see where it goes. Cause I'm in this for the money, right? So just food for thought guys. I might do a little bit of a touch up video on that a little bit later. Uh, should I hold Jasmine in my portfolio? Maybe a little bit later today or something. We'll see, but Enjoy your day, guys. It's raining outside. It's miserable. But guess what? Here I am outside enjoying the rain with my little guy. Stepped away from the portfolio. You guys should do the same. 
hit the like button, guys. Hit the subscribe button. Click the uh, join button to become a member of the channel. Supports the channel. Get micro cap gem videos. Uh, or sorry, live streams on Sundays. Uh, get help with your portfolio structure, with your exit strategies, with your profit taking. Um, join the Discord. Follow me on X. And um, yeah, like and subscribe. Hey, bud. Say, hey, Bryson. Say, Jasmine. Jasmine. That's right. All right. See you guys later.